welcome to the another demo of the virtual scribe now we are going to just use it in the like in the classroom using powerpoint play, um, powerpoint as a blackboard or a whiteboard um, to write on like a digital board basically um, as you see here again this is the device replaces the keyboard the mouse the traditional pen ink and paper and also the pointing device which I'll be showing you in a minute as well as you can see on top here we have the pointing device um, showing just at the top over here uh, which we can use actually um, in our presentation so this is a laser pen um, that will be activated um, to, to use basically as you can see here I can just use it on my screen whilst I'm presenting some things and the same I can use um, yeah, actually as a remote control for my presentations well, alright so let's go on and open Microsoft PowerPoint and obviously you can use it in open office as well so I'll show that one later on in other sessions so let's open PowerPoint and we can just go into slide show and we have a whiteboard actually so if imagine that this is a big screen so you can project it like with a beamer and you are having your classes in a university class or a, a normal class um, giving courses to your students you just can use this to browse uh, to do your things you are presenting so I can use this one now to start writing actually what I want to present to my students and I can start writing actually anything I want so let's say today's course yeah so I can just write down the what it will be we'll be talking about some mathematics we will be doing some formulas explanations they they say so this will be my blackboard or my whiteboard to write on I can obviously save it and so I will keep my notes actually in it I will open a new slide because I can give this as handouts actually to the students uh, whilst they are doing their following the courses and share it in a very easy way actually so students don't need to really take notes anymore but they can take what I'm writing and focus on the things that they are really um, um, need to focus on to understand the course basically so I can save this and I can insert a new slide um, which I will use as the next uh, to write on so again I can go back into um, into this mode and then start here also writing the next course so as I prepare my courses I can already uh, know how many sheets maybe I'll be needing and I can start here with today we will maybe um, taking um, things like this and yeah so we can say like what is x so let me erase this I made the mistake so I can just go back and find the eraser and I say I don't need that actually so I'll come back here and I'll use my filter 
So I want the class now to find x for me and then the x can actually do all kind of things and they will come to like, okay, then x is blah, 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 blah. And so when we do that is we can say like the uh, x is then will be like two or x is minus two, right? Something like that can be the answer. Yeah, so we can do a whole lot of things uh, from with this with this device actually, and so that is a demo of using PowerPoint presentations to do your things. Obviously, I can use this also um, as a pointing device, like I told you earlier. So I can use it actually to present um, what I was showing. So I can ask the students basically like um, a few things like if I'm talking about x and x is uh, x to the power 2 is 4 what is x and then the students can calculate it with me and we will find these answers basically over here and whilst we're doing that obviously we can make highlights as well and um, we can go here for example and I say let's take the highlighter and start actually highlighting some some things like if x to the power 2 is 4 what is x and yeah so as you see we can do a whole lot of things with this thing so the answers are written over here and students we can save this and send it backwards to the students basically so we can say end the show now i want to end the show and save this one and as you see what we have been discussing the above or here as we can see all right and obviously i can view it also back as a slideshow obviously so i can go to the next and end the show so that was it using the virtual scribe to do some powerpoint presentations and obviously you can also build a complete presentation actually so let me show you that as well so we can click here and add the text basically and I can write this was course one and then I can make my notes here we did some math and we do some formulas and etc. So that is it. Let me zoom in so you can see what I'm writing. So that is what we were discussing earlier and that is what we have done till now. So bye for now, thank you. Using the virtual scribe can enhance your life and that of the environment. No paper needed, no stress, no sweat. Just use it as you are used to in your natural movements. Bye for now.